Okay, everything's a wreck. <laughs> kitchen today. I put in that switch, turned the electricity back on, I tested it, it's good. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put everything back together until I've done them all, tested them all, you know, in case I need to redo anything. So I don't have to you know take everything back out. I have to work on these two. And I gotta do the one behind the coffee pot, which is gonna be this double wire, so it'll be a little bit more of a pain in the ass. The biggest pain in the ass is the one you came and kind of can see back there but yeah i'm gonna have to move everything don't even know what i showed you in here um this table's going i have hinges on the floor that are going to go into this wall i've got a butcher block countertop that i'm going to cut and stain it's going to fold down right there i gotta take this off the wall and put it over there because um I don't know the wall is like not totally level or something and i went to put this cabinet up and i couldn't where my board was it's way easier to just hold this one and then lock it to this big one so anyway but anyway i gotta wait for more wall anchors because there's no that that's a two by four that's a two by four the other two are buried on the window edges so this is literally held up by four drywall anchors that look like well, that's a, they look like that, but that's not a good representation of them. And I mean, they're kind of like, they're, they're that, but you know, I got more coming. Uh, Cause I'm gonna need some for this too. Cause I'm only gonna, like I said, you see this one's only gonna line up with that one stud. So I'm gonna need to use wall anchors there too. I still gotta get my four pieces of ply. My four pieces of, of birch plywood. But yeah, everything else is totally done in this room except for all the the parts that I hit you know I'm gonna have to fill in holes and repaint and then I've got to do my touch-up spots where I thought I was gonna use different trim so I'm gonna do like that and that and put more paint on the wall and uh, <clears throat> I mean eventually we'll have to uh, when we actually rent it out we're gonna to have to have a professional come in here and redo the walls anyway um, because all this shit ain't gonna fly all this bad, these bad imperfections that I'm unable to fix with my, with my non-skill level. But yeah, so that's your update in here. But right now, back to electricity. <laughs> stainless steel counter piece that's going to go on the end here and then all the you know all the, the little covering the little cover pieces for all the cabinets and this wall will be done and I gotta do this whole thing <laughs> one of these days it'll be over one of these days the fun will be done
caddy wampus. Because I crushed everything in there. If you look, if you saw earlier, I mean, I've got time lapse, so you probably won't be able to see. But you know, I, I did all the wires together, and then I pushed all the wires back in the wall, and then I just had a single wire coming into the box, into the box. I've got a bunch of wires in there, which is causing, you know, this can't seat properly. But whatever, it works. I tested it, it works. That's what I care about. It's fine. Looks a little wonky. You can always fix it down the line. I can't do the last one until I get another box anyway. Um, I'll double check, make sure I don't have one, but I'm pretty sure I don't.